Neurology quiz number nine. What is anti iglon 5 disease? The iglon proteins are a family of neural cell adhesion molecules. Anti iglon 5 disease is associated with antibody to iglon 5. The disease has an association with HLA DRB1 and HLA DBQ1. The condition can also occur as a paraneoplastic syndrome. Usual age of onset is 45 to 75 years. Four major clinical presentations occur. A sleep disorder with parasomnia and sleep breathing difficulty, both central and obstructive sleep apnea. A bulbar syndrome with dysphagia, sialuria, strider and acute respiratory insufficiency. A syndrome resembling progressive supranuclear palsy with vertical and horizontal gaze palsies and gait difficulty and cognitive decline with chorea. Other features include dysautonomia and myoclonus. Pathological features include neuronal loss and p-tau protein accumulation in hypo, uh, hypothalamus and brainstem tegmentum. The antibody is found in serum and CSF in more than 90% of cases. Some series have reported high mortality as much as 34%. Response to immunotherapy has been poor, but there are some reports that combination immunotherapy may be more effective. What are the indications, mechanism of action, and side effects of the newly introduced anti-epileptic drug Sinobamate? Sinobamate is a new AED approved for medical use in the United States in November 2019 for treatment of partial onset seizures in patients more than 18 years old. In clinical trials, it showed impressive reduction in focal seizures versus placebo up to 91%. It is a sodium channel inhibitor and a positive allosteric modulator of the GABA ion channel. Dosing requires a slow titration schedule. Starting dose is 12.5 mg per day and dose is increased at two week intervals to a maintenance dose of 200 mg per day. The maximum dose is 400 mg per day. Most common side effects are dizziness, sleepiness, headache, double vision and fatigue. Serious side effects include drug reaction with eosinophilia and systemic symptoms or dress, shortening of QT interval and suicidal ideation. Safety in pregnancy has not been established. Dose reduction may be considered in patients with mild to moderate renal insufficiency and use is not recommended in patients with end-stage renal disease. Effectiveness of oral contraceptives may be reduced when given concomitantly with sinobamate. Doses of phenytoin, phenobarbital and clo clobosam may need to be reduced when given concomitantly with sinobamate, while doses of carbamazepine and lamotrigine may need to be increased. Sinobamate is a Schedule 5 controlled substance. What are the neurological indications and side effects of azathioprine or imuran? It is most commonly used as an immunosuppressive agent in myasthenia gravis, inflammatory muscle disease, and NMOSD. It is initiated at 50 mg q day, is increased by 50 mg q week to 100 to 150 mg per day given in two divided doses. Maximum dose is usually 200 mg per day. Peak beneficial effect may require 4 to 8 months. 5 to 10% of patients develop an idiosyncratic reaction in the first two weeks with fever, skin rash, nausea, vomiting, myalgias, and elevated liver enzymes. This requires discontinuation of the medication as it recurs on rechallenge. Dose related myelosuppression and neutropenia occur in 10%. Hepatotoxicity, usually mild, occurs in 15%. Both of these effects can resolve with decrease in dose. Patients should have monitoring of CBC and LFT every week for the first month, every two, week, two weeks for the next two months, then monthly for the next three months, and subsequently every one to three months. Other side effects include pancreatitis and a small increase in the risk of malignancy, especially skin cancer. Allopurinol can inhibit its metabolism and requires a decrease in the dose.